RFK Jr. is at it again, trying to debunk the value of vaccines. This time, he tries to show that sanitation and nutrition are what account for the huge decline in mortality since the 1900s, and that vaccines had nothing to do with the increase in life expectancy. Let's just take mortality to begin with. It is true that sanitation and nutrition improved in the early part of the 20th century and brought mortality down and life expectancy up. But after about 1955, when the polio vaccine was first introduced, vaccines had a lot to do with the improved health of the country and the decreased mortality. And it turns out that vaccines actually dramatically improve our quality of life and reduce the complications of serious illness. For example, just before the polio vaccine was introduced, 21,000 Americans per year ended up paralyzed from polio. If we extrapolate that to today, if we didn't have a vaccine, that would be 45,000 Americans each year getting paralyzed because of polio. Indeed, Robert Kennedy's own Department of Health and Human Services estimates that people born between 1994 and 2023, 1.1 million of them will have their lives saved because of childhood vaccines. So ignore what he says on Instagram and continue to get your vaccines.